Hi, I'm Laurent Timmermans. Welcome to Atinesia, and in this video, we'll be discussing about carrying a loss forward. Now, what I mean by carrying a loss forward is that if your business accumulated loss over the last few years, you know, how, how long can you carry this loss uh, in the future? Okay. Uh, in many European countries, basically after a few years, three years, five years, uh, this loss is, is lost, that's it. You, know, you, can't, you can't keep it in your books. But in Hong Kong, you can carry your loss forward forever. Okay, which means that if for two, three, four, five years you have been in loss and you make, I don't know, you accumulated, I don't know, two million in loss because I don't know, you, were, you were startups and you were investing your money to develop the product or to try to, to find you in your service. You were not that successful, you know, uh, it took a while and you had to hire people, but you had no return. Basically, these, these become a loss and you can carry it forward. If one day you start suddenly to make money, let's say you make uh, 3 million, then you won't pay tax on 3 million, you will pay tax on 3 minus 2, so 1, 1 million. So you'll pay tax on 1 million uh, for, for that year. So that's the good news in Hong Kong and that's a perfect um, system for, uh, for, for, for businesses that will have loss for sure, like startups that require a lot of, uh, of years to run, to develop a product or something before being profitable, uh, for example. So that's a good system. Um, I won't talk too much about it because, I mean, there's not much to say. It's good to know. So in Hong Kong, you can carry your loss uh, forward forever. So if you like this video, put a thumbs up, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one.